Why you wanna run away? Why you gotta be? Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. <laughs> It was a moment of pure joy and excitement. I couldn't contain my happiness. As I wiped my house, a notification popped up on my phone. I had reached a major milestone, a thousand subscribers. So stay tuned as we clean my house and celebrate this milestone together. Imagine a serene bedroom, bathed in soft light, awaiting a touch of renewal. As I embarked on my cleaning journey, I turned my attention to the windows, the gateway to the outside world. With a gentle touch, I wiped all the accumulated dust, allowing the vibrant sunlight to flood the room. Its stroke revealed a clearer view, unveiling the beauty of the world outside. It was a simple act, yet it brought a sense of freshness and renewed energy to my sanctuary. Let's clean my bedroom. With a rag in hand and a bucket of water nearby, I embarked on the next step of cleaning the floor. The rag became my trusty companion, ready to tackle the debris and restore the floor to its former glory. Gently pressing the darkened rag against the surface, I moved it back and forth with purposeful movements. As the rag glided across the floor, it gracefully lifted away the remnants of everyday life. In that moment, I realized that cleaning the floor wasn't merely a chore. It was an act of self-care and a celebration of the sanctuary I had created. The simple act of restoring the floor to its pristine state reflected a deeper desire to cultivate an environment that nurtures my well-being. With a rug and a bucket of water, I had unlocked the transformative power of cleaning, elevating the energy of the room and infusing it with a renewed sense of purpose. With fresh sheets in hand, I clearly draped them over the mattress, ensuring a smooth and wrinkle-free surface. Each corner was tucked in with precision, securing the foundation of a restful sleep. As I smoothened out the fabric, a serene hush seemed to settle upon the room as if the bed itself welcomed the embrace of cleanliness. With a delicate touch, I spread over the duvet, a cocoon of coziness that promised restful night and peaceful dreams. It enveloped the bed, its soft folds cascading gently, as if inviting me to surrender to its embrace. Next, I adorned the bed with a cover and pillows, the plushness inviting me to sink into the world of relaxation. Each pillow was fluffed in position just so, adding a touch of elegance and warmth to the pristine canvas of the bed. Let us make my bed. As I took a step back, 
a smile of contentment spread over my face. In this moment, I realized the significance of making my bed. It was a symbolic act that set the tone of the day and offered a sense of order that means the cares of life. As I settled into the softness of the bed, I couldn't help but feel a wave of gratitude wash over, over me. Making my bed is a ritual of self-care, a daily reminder to embrace the peace and serenity that awaited me each night. I hope you are now motivated to clean your room. Please deep clean your room. After my workout, the next day, I am back to cleaning my living room. Let us do this together and administer the rhythm of cleaning. A notification hit my phone. I had hit a thousand subscribers. To my team, my cherished subscribers and community, I extend my deepest gratitude. It is your unwavering support and engagement that has fueled the growth of this shared journey. Each and every one of you has played an invaluable role in reaching this incredible milestone. With every subscription, every comment, every interaction, you have brought life and vitality to our digital family. Your presence has transformed my channel into a thriving community. If you just joined us for the first time, please consider subscribing, liking this video, and leaving a comment. To celebrate together, I will be doing a giveaway, so stay tuned for a giveaway coming your way very soon. You can comment on what you want me to give away in this video. Let us hop on to cleaning the windows together. With kind attention, I cleaned the windows, wiping away the dust and smudges that obscured my view. The transparent paints came to life, mirroring the excitement and clarity that filled my heart. It was as if with every stroke I was cleaning, a path of light was entering, a symbolic act of inviting positivity into my space. Next, I directed my efforts towards the centerpiece of the room, the table and TV stand. With care, I dusted away the remnants of the past, ensuring their surfaces radiated with a renewed luster. The table stood as a symbol of connection, a gathering place where stories are shared and laughter is amplified. Of course, alone, because I live alone. The TV stand held a promise of shared entertainment and moments of collective excitement. I ensured it is clean as much as I could. Let us clean my living room. With the determination, I knelt down and grabbed a rug, immersing it in a bucket of water. The cold touch of water against my hands served as a reminder of the task at hand to bring a fresh gleam to the living room. Starting at one end, I carefully wrung out the excess water from the rug, ensuring it was damp but not dripping. As I continued my cleaning ritual, the scent of cleanliness permeated the air, transforming the atmosphere of the room each stroke of the rug was a symbol of renewal, a tangible expression of my dedication to create a welcoming space. With each moment, the floor regained its former luster, the pattern tiles inviting a renewed sense of serenity and tranquility to the room. Give me that, give me that 
Give my attention to the door. I wiped the fingerprints, smudges and dust that had accumulated on its surface. Each swipe brought the door back to life, revealing its color and allowing its features to shine. So I got this delivered from Carrefour as I was cleaning so I'm gonna let us open it together. They are just cleaning the ingredients that I needed but okay. It's a long story. So I got the kitchen cleaner from me. Got the carpet and I'll also clean up. Bathroom cleaner. So my cleaning is about to have a work. Here we go. So my carpet got um stained. By mistake, coffee spilled on my carpet. So somebody suggested that this one will really work. And I want to clean my six so to honor how it works out, my bathroom of course, I want to try out this then the stains that I have on my cooker. I hope this one also helps. So let us try together and see how it goes. So first I'll clean up the seats, the carpet, so that I can finish up the sitting room and head to the kitchen. Armed with the astonished fabric cleaner, I am back to cleaning my sofa sets. I kept the soft brush, I gently agitated the cleaner into the fabric causing out any stain. With its circular motion, the fibers came to life, the original vibrancy returning. As I proceeded, I could visibly witness the difference astonished products made. The stubborn marks had gradually faded away. With diligent care, I methodically worked my way across my entire sofa set, ensuring no spot was left untouched. The satisfaction grew with each stain removed. As if I was breathing new life into every sense of the sofa set. The fabric, now free of dirt and imperfections, radiated with a renewed beauty, inviting relaxation and serenity. Onto my carpet, there was a coffee stain, but I decided to use the Astonish products. Let me tell you, the Astonish products are the best. They did a whole job. I don't think my camera is doing it justice, but the stain got off. The best product to use for any stain. I carefully soaked every nook and cranny of the bathroom, ensuring the astonished cleaner reached even the hidden corners. Its powerful formula worked magic. With a brush in hand, I focused my attention onto the toilet, the unsung hero of hygiene. Applying the astonished bathroom cleaner directly to my bowl, I scrubbed away any stubborn stain or residue. With its circular motion, the cleaner mighty action broke down the dirt revealing the sparkling white porcelain breath as i worked i knew i was creating a safe haven for myself
to the astonished bathroom cleaner, I had successfully transformed my bathroom into a haven of cleanliness. It really did the job. Its powerful cleaning prowess had allowed me to restore each element to its original beauty, creating an environment that was both inviting and hygienic. I stepped back this bathroom was really clean you guys you need to try the astonished products that's for sure I moved to the sink the bathroom cleaner from astonish really gave my sink a certain sheen it had never had before I used it on my tub I used it on every corner of that sink it was really sparkless at the end of this trust me you I'm never stopping my usage of the storage products. That's for sure, that's for sure, that's for sure. You were my best friend. Didn't care about the rules, good on the week. Onto my kitchen, I used warm water and the Astonish kitchen cleaner. I used it to clean the surfaces and wipe the doors. At least every stain was wiped off. And then I cleaned my cooker. There was a, there was a certain stain here that was really persistent. Guess what? Astonished did the thing. It was sparkless by the end of this. And I just soaked it for some minutes. So I'm sure next time it will do way better. So some as a stain are over for me in the kitchen. Let us clean my kitchen with you guys. After completing the cleaning, I rewarded myself with a lemon biscuit and mango smoothie. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and leave a comment. To see a full mango smoothie recipe, please check my short section. Adios. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. Don't forget we'll be having a giveaway in the next video. I love you guys. Mwah. You and me so cool.